Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Professor Layton 5, made by Level 5. In this video, we will begin Chapter 5. And first, we are going to have a recap of what's happened so far. So far, we had the Levitation Incident, where everybody was levitated into the air. The police decided to arrest Dalston for, um, reasons? Chapter 5, Miracles Unmasked. This chapter begins with another recap. After finding the truth behind the masked gentleman's past miracles, we went to the Gallery Plaza. There, we witnessed innocent bystanders being lifted into the air before they disappeared. Within minutes, the police arrested Alphonse Dalston on suspicion of aiding the masked gentleman. Could it be that he was the mastermind behind this series of incidents? As dawn broke on our third day in Montedor, I wondered... Had we come any closer to the truth? So I hope you enjoyed both of those recaps, because we are going to get a third recap right after we finish talking to Luke. Yeah, Luke, Emmy's right. If you just want to go to sleep, that would be okay. Just go to sleep. You're not really that important to this investigation. Okay, and here we go. Recap time. Tonight, at Pumpkin Park, the masked gentleman is going to reappear. In the meantime, let's forget about the amusement park and focus on Dalston. Previously, we were investigating Dalston because he's creepy and evil and obviously guilty. But now we've decided that he's not creepy, and he's totally a good guy and completely innocent of all charges. And that's basically what we're going to focus on. We're going to try to find a way to prove that Dalston is innocent. I don't know, it just seems sort of strange to me that our heroes put so much effort into proving Dalston guilty, and now they're putting an equal amount of effort into proving that he's innocent, based on the fact that a tiger said he was innocent. Yeah... So let's talk to the tiger again. Is this tiger really certain that Dalston is innocent? What if it's a lying tiger? Not to be confused with a lion tiger. Lying tigers and lion tigers are completely different things. Puzzle number 65, Kitty Solitaire 2. 
Just like last time, you want to jump all of the cats, and you want to finish like this. That's going to be your finishing move. So that means all your other moves are going to be moving the white cats. So let's see, that's this cat down, this cat diagonal, and this cat diagonal. Now that the cats are in a group here, a group of four, you can take this cat in the upper left and jump all of the other ones. Just like this. Down. Diagonal. And down. Finish by moving the black cat. And that's your solution. Is this my answer? I did it, Professor! Alright! Okay, so we are headed to City Hall, where Dalston is being questioned. We want to see his questioning, right? Because we have to be there in order to prove that he's innocent. Hopefully we actually have proof that Dalston is innocent. I thought the proof would be that Dalston can't be the masked gentleman because he's way too fat to fit inside the costume, but apparently that doesn't count. There's also the fact that Dalston and the masked gentleman were seen together at the same time, so they can't be the same person. Yeah. However, the police are dead certain that Dalston is the culprit. Puzzle number 66, a trip to the hospital. A math puzzle. Okay, great. So, this man went to visit the hospital. So, he, he starts at his front door and he goes 500 meters. 500 meters. Then he stops, goes back to the flower shop, then goes from the flower shop to the hospital, and that's 800 meters. And then after that, he goes home. So you need to figure out how far this person traveled in total. It's not the easiest puzzle, and um, this sentence right here, the flower shop is on a straight line between his house and the hospital, 800 meters from the hospital, that is an awkwardly phrased sentence. It, it does not help the puzzle. In any case, your solution is going to be uh, 500 plus 800. That's 500 plus 800. Multiply that by 2 because he went there once and then he went back. So that would be 2600 meters. Just a dash of puzzle solving here. Just a dash. That was a challenge, to be sure. You have to wonder if Professor Layton says that when he's busy cooking things in the kitchen. Just a dash of salt over here. Just a dash of pepper on the lettuce. There, now I have the perfect puzzle salad. Oh, those tomatoes remind me of a puzzle. And I believe we can solve one more puzzle before the end of this video.
Puzzle number 67, Language of Love. What you want to do is find a hidden message inside this room. What you need to do is tap two things to get the hidden message. So there are several things you can tap here. The solution is this, you want to turn off the light and then turn on the lamp. And your message is a heart. I got it, no problem. You brought what? You brought your puzzle solving skills? Good job, Luke, good job. You know, he's got a point. You think the masked gentleman could spend his money helping the homeless or something like that? Rather than pretending to turn people into statues and turn people into horses. I suppose that's why he's a villain rather than a good Samaritan.